Hello, I'm Dr. Chris Bramlett, and today I will be sharing a brief story from Albemarle's history. The T.E. White's home that was located just south of the corner of North 2nd Street and Montgomery Avenue was thought to have been built prior to 1890. It's unclear who the first owner might have been, but the home was purchased by White, the first depot agent for the Yadkin Railroad, in 1891. Fred Morgan once shared the story that the home at the time was surrounded by woods and that Whites would carry a shotgun and kill game on his way to work at the depot. The Whites family lived in the home until 1916 when they sold it to Eli Kendrick. Kendrick later sold the home to Dr. J.A. Allen of New London. During the mid-1950s, the home was demolished and a new A&P grocery store was built where the Whites home once stood. According to old city phone directories, this business was at this location from about 1955 until about 1975. After the grocery store left, the building was then empty a couple of years. In 1978, it was occupied by some sort of carpet business. The State Employment Security Commission was in the front space from about 1979 until about 1999, followed by a series of small businesses. In addition, the ARC, now known as Monarch, along with the doll boutique and a hair salon, were in the building as well. Today, the A&P building has been renovated and is the home of the Stanley Arts Guild. 